Hi, I'm Francis, the host of this show, Cooking with the Dog. こんにちは。今日はアスパラガスをエビで巻いてビッグなエビフライを作ります。食べ応えありますよ。First, let's make the quick and easy tartar sauce. Rub the chopped onion with a pinch of salt. Rinse with fresh water and strain in a mesh strainer. Place the onion onto a paper towel and remove the excess moisture. Then add the onion to a bowl with the mayonnaise. Add the chopped cucumber, vinegar, sugar, salt, and pepper. Combine all the ingredients. Finally, add a small amount of milk to adjust the consistency. Now, the sauce is ready. After de shelling and de veining with a bamboo stick, rinse the prawn with salt water thoroughly. Remove the sharp pointed part from the tail fin. Cut off the end of the tail diagonally. Then press the excess moisture out with a paper towel. This will help to prevent the hot oil from puffing while deep frying the prawn. Make a deep cut along the stomach to open the prawn like a butterfly. Be careful not to separate it. Because of this process, you shouldn't make a cut along the back of the prawn to remove the sand vein. For detailed preparation for prawn, check out our previous e b i fry video. With the kitchen shears, make a cut along the last shell segment and open that section too. Now, Make numerous shallow cuts along the prawn crosswise and also lengthwise. Cover it with plastic wrap. Then, pound the prawn with a rolling pin. Flattening the prawn will help to wrap the asparagus later. こちらのグリーンアスパラガスを芯にして巻きます。Peel the bottom third of the green asparagus with a peeler. Wrap it with a plastic wrap and microwave at 600 watts for 20 seconds. Cut the asparagus to the same length as the prawn. Lightly season them with salt. And pepper. Then wrap the asparagus with the prong. Next, soak the spring roll rice paper wrapper in water and place it onto a flat surface. Place the prong onto the center and tightly roll it in the rice paper. The wrapper will help the prong and the asparagus firmly attach together. Now, two large torpedoes are ready to fire. Let's bread the prawns. First, coat the prawn with all purpose flour. Next, coat it with a beaten egg. Finally, cover it with panko or bread crumbs. Repeat the process and you'll have two large breaded prawns. Now, 
e d flying oil to 170 to 175 degrees Celsius in a pot. Then, gently place the prawns into it. When the temperature is right, small bubbles should form around the breadcrumbs. Occasionally shake the pot to brown evenly. Ladle the hot oil over the e b b fry. Now flip them over. The asparagus is already cooked and the prawn is flattened, so the cooking time should be relatively short. Continue to ladle on the hot oil. Deep fry for a total of about 2 minutes until deliciously browned. Drain the excess oil thoroughly. And then place the ebi fry onto a cooling rack covered with a paper towel. Then place them onto a plate along with the side vegetables and the homemade tartar sauce. Squeeze over the lemon juice and enjoy the ebi fry with the tartar sauce. You can also use Japanese u s t a s h i a sauce or your favorite type of sauce instead. Okay, ebi fry, ebi zuki ni wa tomarimasen. Be sure not to overcook the ebi fry, otherwise, the prawn becomes tough. Good luck in the kitchen! 今日はこちらのグリーン。<笑>